check this out. All right, this is this is so cool. So uh, we're checking out here. Uh, let's let me grab the camera. So actually, we can compare here. This is the e-ink laptop, the first e-ink laptop in the world, right here, the Onyx typewriter. And I'm at maximum brightness on this uh, awesome, of course, awesome ARM-powered laptop. This is a Samsung Chromebook Plus. But check a little bit. The, it's impossible to see the screen. Uh, I mean, outdoors. I mean, of course, it is possible if you're really in front of it. But as soon as you can start going inside, and uh, so let's talk about this. Hello. So who are you? Hello, it's Andrew from Onyx International. Uh, we are here in uh, Hong Kong Fair, one year consecutive, and uh, we are introducing our latest products. Uh, this is, uh, as Nicola said, is our typer, our latest uh, product. And, uh, of course, we have other, other new items really interesting for this year. So this, uh, there's, there's a huge potential of this, and this is even uh, detachable. Let's, let's type some more, uh, we can... Oh, there, we changed to Chinese. Okay. So it's for typing text, but potentially also could synchronize from uh, any Chromebook, from any smartphone. Yes. yes. And you since, could have documents here since, and work with them. Yeah, since our devices uh, work, uh, uh, besides uh, Wi Fi, they also have uh, Bluetooth technology. It's uh, really interesting because you can uh, send your, your your documents from the computer to the to the typer. So uh, at the end, it's uh, it's amazing. You can you can share every all the all the documents. All right. Uh, let's try to. Uh, I'm gonna try to go there. Okay. I'm just gonna reboot it so you can show the cool booting animation. So actually, um, there's. Oh no, actually it's not rebooting. Um, this is running Android, so there's all kinds of potential that could be ha happening with Android right here. Uh, I'm thinking if there's the perfect application that kind of synchronizes, that optimizes stuff for the for the e-ink display, because e-ink has an advantage. The battery life is how long? The battery life, if we in standby, our devices it, it takes uh, between 20 and 25 days. Of course, if we are using Bluetooth, uh, the devices that uh, also use Frontlight, uh, but the battery life would go to 10. 10 days, 15 days, so depending on, on the use. You just said 25 days if battery it, life in a standby on the laptop. This is a 20. Yeah, I understand. But a standby, okay. But it, we're talking days. The, this this guy is awesome. But we're talking eight, nine hours battery life. Okay. This guy can maybe do. Eight of course, nine days. Our, our, it, uh, because our devices uh, has a lower battery consumption. At the same time, we we have developed a new microchip that uh, 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 along along to the motherboard uh, achieve a better a better uh, low low uh, consumption. So at the end, we can we can reach this amount of uh, of days. Uh, of course, I repeat, in a standby. If we are using the Bluetooth, if we are using the Wi-Fi, if we are using the front light, of course, this amount of day, it's, it's reduced to, uh, to between one week, two weeks. Yes. Okay, <laughs> we're talking one week, two weeks. It sounds so awesome. And you can, you can go out in the sun. You can go and, and uh, sit by the, by the sea. Okay, you can go on the boat. You can go in the park and you can actually do some work. Exactly. And get natural sunlight. And the most important thing that we, in Nonix we try to focus, since we, we, we are professionals of the e-ink industry since 2008, is that at the end, for the people that work all day long in their office, uh, in front of the computer, what we achieve with that is that you can be working without, at the end of the day, uh, uh, your sight, it's not tired. So you can work all day long, even if you are reading an e-reader, or you, if now you are typing your, your Onyx uh, International Books typer. So uh, guys out there, developers, uh, please make an awesome Android app that just is perfect for this. I think this huge potential for synchronization, all kinds of stuff that could happen that could just make it so usable. Can you detach the screen and show, show off? You can, you can even remove the screen. Yes, of course.
so it also works like this of course then it becomes like a more standard reader yes it's huge at the, the keyboard speaker. appears once it detects that the, it has been disconnected from the from the typer uh, it it understands it and appear uh, uh, and actually uh, there's even a, a placement for pen over here yes so there would be a pen on this side exactly so you can actually use a pen that could be a wacom or exactly Kanban. that actually would be like our 9.7 n96 device is the same screen size but the thing is that we have put it together with the with the with yeah. the typer so cool so um Onyx is one of the leaders in e-ink device and also even more one of the leaders in e-ink Android device. Yes. Um, what's the size of the screen? The screen is 9.7 inches. 9.7, but potentially there could be different versions, different size, because you have all kinds of sizes. We, uh, we are a company that constantly we are developing new devices and improving our current devices. So um, for sure, why not? In the future, we, we, we can have some uh, great news as, as this other one, one of our also latest product yeah. of 2017 this is the 10.3 uh, e-reader this is this is plastic it's not a glass screen it's plastic it's flexible it's super yes. light it's this potentially could also be a screen right oh, oh, maybe you can hold it yeah. so this could potentially be uh, the screen right here yes mobius carta 10.3 inch yes and you have 13.3 inch also you have you have a six Point something. We have devices, six inches devices. We have six point eight dev uh, inches device. We have the nine point seven. We have the the newest ten point three. Yeah, we're gonna do a different video about this guy because this is also completely amazing. This is fantastic, and uh, all these. It depends what the market because right now this is not officially. Uh, you don't know exactly when it's going to be released, right? Exactly. What, how soon could it be, maybe? Uh, second half of 2017, there is uh, still not a release uh, uh, data, but uh, of course, uh, in 2017, uh, the, at least this one, this guy here, 10.3, will be released in the second half of, of the year. The typer probably it's going to be at the beginning of 2018. It's still not not exact date, as I said. So, but. Uh, our customers will be will be informed about okay, that. Okay, let's just continue. Let's continue okay. this video. I don't want to stop it, because let's talk about this guy. This is the lightest, uh, flexible in theory, but don't do it in theory. You drop it on the floor; it's not going to break. And it's a uh, uh, flush with the sides. Um, very high resolution. Was it uh, 18, 20? What is it? This is a uh, one. Uh this is one uh, one thousand uh, two hundred uh, forty. One thousand eight hundred seventy-two times fourteen oh four. So crazy resolution. Yeah. I've never seen it before. Yeah. It's four by three. You think it's only one thousand two? I think it's one thousand eight hundred. I'll post it in the comments. Uh, let's let's do some uh, notes. Yeah. The one and another of the newest thing of this one is that the that before our other devices work with electromagnetic pen, this one we have improved to a, to a, to an active pen. So this is Wacom. Wacom this Touch. Okay. Okay. Uh, this is too awesome. Let's do a bigger font. Yeah. And it seems to be just as fast as paper. Maybe not. Qu I mean, of course, I'm joking, but it seems as fast as any tablet that you have out there. It's like an iPad Pro. It's like a uh, really fast. What's really it called? Fast. The Microsoft thing. The it's like a Microsoft Slate or what they call it. Uh, it's like uh, anything out there. It seems the refresh rate is just amazing with with writing on this one, and it's so thin. The bezels are so thin. It's so light. It could potentially be even lighter, right? Yes. Do, do you know what the weight the weight is right now? Uh, this one is a uh, uh, ten point five millimeters. Of, ten point five millimeter thickness. Okay. Thickness, yeah. That's also not final, right? It could be even thinner. Yeah, it could be, but actually, uh, the final, the final uh, e-reader is going to be almost like this. If there is any change, the change will be minimal, minimal. All right. Can I write something? Of course. Okay. Uh, you are, you are with the. Okay. Uh, you have to change. Yeah. Okay. Again, okay, you can do. Yeah. Okay. So you change it to the pen. Yes. 
Then? Okay. And then I do, uh, let's do, put some ears, uh, eyes, wow. nose, and mouth. And then we, we, okay. Okay, that's great. Uh, so this guy is going to be, well, we don't know how much, but let's hope that you get a million sales and that you can sell it for crazy low price. So? There's no price yet, right? No, and there's no this. price yet, yeah, yeah. No Don't price. ask me this because it's still no price. It's still no price. Okay, 199. Okay, no, I'm joking. But it'd be, <laughs> it'd be awesome to... Okay, I'm thinking students, uh, professionals, yeah, uh, different creators. Kind of. I like to hope that I'm, eventually I'll be a creator. Like, people need to be able to read any document. Let's go in documents. Let's see how it looks. Okay, I'm going back to yes. home menu. Uh, it's first the saving. Saving. I have here all the documents. Yeah. We go back to the menu. So it's running a NXP processor, which might soon be a Qualcomm because uh, Qualcomm is buying it. Ah, this. Okay, let's open uh, this this book. Okay, this is how the text looks. Uh, people out there. Really sharper. Oh my God, it's beautiful. And now I can select some text. I think you can select or no. Yeah. Yep. And you have yep. here the... Uh, the, the... No, I just did the... What's it called? The, okay, maybe you can select some text. Because that's that would be a use case. You select a bunch of text and then you annotate. Okay, but this, this could be done differently, I guess. And you can copy, highlight, annotate something, translate it in the dictionary or even TTS. Yeah, the, the, there's a huge potential in annotating text, reading documents, yeah. working, collaborating on PDF, yeah. on Word documents, collaborating over Google Drive. Yes. Okay, you have some work to do. What's your job? What do you do? Actually, I'm a sales representative and also marketing representative for earnings in Europe, uh, now staying in China uh, for in order to improve in our latest products. But yes, our main uh, goal is to, to to open new markets in Europe uh, with our latest uh, products. You're from Spain, right? I am from Spain, from Barcelona. How, f how popular do you think this kind of product is in Spain? I mean, this product still is not in Spain. There is not a... But of course, there is a six inches device and it's, 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 it's doing great. It's doing great. Because uh, hopefully, well, we'll see what the return match is going to be against Juventus, but maybe they'll have holiday soon. And so that means they will be able to uh, go on the beach and uh, read. We will pass. We will pass the eliminator. Okay. <laughs> Maybe not. They will, they will come back. But okay. But otherwise, there's very good weather in Spain, so people can you know get yeah, out in the sun yeah. and get a good reader and of get course. some work done. Still. Yes, of course. At the same so time, so it should be a huge market. So hopefully, yeah. you'll be very busy in the future. All right. That's cool. That's beautiful.